Hello. First of all, I want to thank you so much for being the model today. If you don't know what's going on, if the receptionist didn't tell you, today you're just literally going to stand there, look at me, try not to move as much. Um, I know it's kind of hard to sit still for a long period of time, but uh, you give me about 10 minutes, um, and that's about as long as you have to kind of stand still. I mean, you don't have to, you know, be super focused like that, but I just need you not to like wobble around, blink too many times. If you have some sore condition, let me know. Uh, so I'm not saying I would get mad at you for moving, but it just makes it a little bit easier for me to draw you if you're not moving as much. So that's what we're doing today though. You're gonna stand there, you're gonna look at me. I'm gonna examine, we're only doing your face, so. Your clothes and stuff, don't worry about it. I know you probably didn't dress up for this, so it's okay. We're not doing your clothes. We're only doing your face. And so I'm gonna draw the features of your face. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get up close. So sorry, I just brushed my teeth. Just had a piece of gum, Tic Tacs, everything. So my breath's not hot, don't worry. Uh, but I'm gonna get up close in your face and try to, I don't wanna say measure, how far your features are or the symmetries of your face, but sort of like that, okay? Um, so before we get started, I have these colored pencils. That was a sharpener. I have all these colored pencils. And we're not gonna do this like, a, you know, I'm not Picasso, I'm not Van Gogh. So we're not trying to make this super realistic. We're just doing this for fun, okay? This is a hobby, this is not a profession. So, um, I'm gonna choose the colors though, not you. Today, you always have no choice in what happens. I'm sorry, but for those that don't like making decisions, today's fun for you. <laughs> I'm gonna pick the colors, but I'm gonna tell you which colors, and I'm gonna draw them on this pad right here that I had. If I can put these pencils up. This pad, I'm gonna show you it's empty, so you know. Empty. Okay, so I don't want you to think that I already pre-drew this because obviously I didn't know who was coming in today. So, all right, we're gonna start off with the simplest of things. Okay, the roundness of your head. So you know, some people have square heads, some people have egg heads. We're gonna do yours, okay? And the color I'm gonna pick. Now I'm not gonna pick it at random, even though I should. I'm gonna make it so you can at least see it on the paper. Oh, I was gonna do something crazy. Um, you know what, we're gonna do blue. We're gonna do blue. Oh, I've never used these, so I didn't know if the silver was blue. So you can see, we're gonna do blue. So, like I said, just hold still. Try not to move. And don't worry if I see anything that different from one side to the other. I'm not gonna, I'm not trying to give you anxiety about the way you look, okay? So I'm just simply here to draw you and ooh, okay. No, 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 that wasn't a bad thing. I just I don't know if blue is going to actually work. Okay, hold still. Actually, I'm going to hold it up right here so I can just keep looking up at you and tell this. That was my mistake. Yeah. Actually, can you can you tilt your head a little bit? Yeah, can you just turn that way? Yeah, exactly. Just eraser. Actually, I have a pretty sharp jaw line. It's kind of nice. I'm a little jealous. Okay. Okay, like I said, that was just the outline of your face, so that wasn't anything crazy. Uh, but we're not going to use blue for, obviously, the in insides of your face. The insides. Uh, the next easiest thing for me is the eyes, the eyeballs. 
Uh, we can we can try to keep this. We can try to keep this realistic a little bit. No, it's not silver. <laughs> green. Um, fun fact. My favorite eye color is green. See, mine sometimes go to green. Sometimes go to brown. It's called hazel. Let's see. Well, hazel also has some of the yellowish in it. Okay. Um. Can can you close this eye for me? Can you close your left eye, please? Okay. And then can you close your right? Okay. I'm just trying. To, just trying to see here. Hold on. Let me get a little closer. Okay, because this is going to be a little harder than I thought it was going to be. Okay, hold still. Please try not to blink. Okay, if you see me looking up and down real quick, it's because I'm trying to look at you and look at the paper. Okay, see, that wasn't that bad. That was probably, that's probably the hardest part, to be honest with you. Because it's kind of hard to, when someone tells you not to blink, you kind of want to blink. That's just how it is. When you know you're not supposed to do something, you want to do it. Um, next, we're going to do, we're going to do your nose. We'll do your nose. Because uh, I want to do your lips red or pink. So don't want to do your nose red or pink, because then it would kind of look the same. But your outer is blue. You can make your nose yellow. Let's do that. Let's make your nose yellow. So your nose is actually going to be pretty simple to draw. Because it looks like, if you see me bobbling like that, I'm on one knee. And it's kind of hard to just sit on one knee like this while I'm trying to lean forward, back, side. So, I'm not drunk. <laughs> just wobbling because I'm on my knee. Uh, okay, like I said, your, your nose is going to be a little easy to draw because it's not big. It's not, you know, it's not like mine. It's not a crazy side profile. But can you give me a side profile real quick? Can you look this way, please? Okay. And now can you look this way? It must be nice to have a nice side profile because... Some of us don't, but all right, I'm gonna hold still. Okay. My paper bent a little bit. See, I told you that was that was the simplest one. That wasn't hard at all. Now your lips. Those are probably gonna be the hardest, okay? So would you prefer pink? There's a lot of shades of pink in here apparently. Would you prefer pink or red for your lips? Obviously pink is more realistic. Reds if you were wearing red lipstick. Which I hope you're not going to sleep wearing red lipstick. We'll do this pink right here on the side. See this pink? I know I told you you weren't going to decide, but listen, I'm not a demanding person. I'm not, I do like to take control, but I always like people's input, okay? These are your lips, so pucker them for me. Pucker means do like that. Okay, can you like smile but without teeth? I'm just trying to see like how absolutely big your lips are. Okay. Pucker again. Okay. We're gonna start by drawing the top one first. Ooh, I messed up a little bit. Okay. Just hold still. Try not to smile, try not to try not to quiver your top lip. 
Okay, um, I'm gonna do your bottom lip real quick. Same thing. Try not to quiver, try not to pucker. Just hold still. Try not to laugh, try not to smile. I know it's hard. I know it's hard. Okay. Almost done. And um, I think it's good enough. Like I said, this is a hobby, not a profession, so you can't judge. Well, that's the only things that we're gonna, I'm going to draw on you today, because like I said, this is a hobby, not a profession, so I can't do the little features like the cheeks and the blush on your cheeks. I can't can't do that just yet. You know, maybe in a couple of years if I keep doing the hobby, then I'll be able to do that. But today, I'm not going to be able to do that. Well, you want to see it? No. No, I'm sorry. Um, just like a, ma a magician, an artist never reveals. That's false, by the way. Uh, artists wouldn't have a career if they didn't reveal their art. <laughs> but today, you're not getting to see it, okay? So anyways, thank you so much for being the model today. Hopefully the receptionist paid you because it is $20 an hour for being here. Um, so thank you so much. Hopefully she did. If she didn't, go see her before you fully leave the building and I will see you later if you decide to come back, okay? Have a great day, bye.